What's going on, Nextinians? It's I, Trey Leo, and we are back once again. This time, Stranger Things Season 3. I, for one, personally, gotta say, this is an amazing series. Season 1 and Season 2, epic, super awesome. I loved them. And I, I knew that it was going to come out with a Season 3, but I didn't know how they were going to spin it. And I still don't understand exactly what the concept may be. I got a couple of ideas that I could spitball to you or whatever, but I'm not going to do that. At least not right now in this video. Maybe, maybe I'll do it. I don't know. Depending on the response to this video, I might give you my opinion on what um, I might think that this this may lie. It's going to come out to 2000. Ugh, damn it. 2019, huh? Well... It's cool. It's cool because I want them to have a airtight seal on this this concept of, of whatever it is that they're going to do for this season. Because I don't want any people to be able to break it down and be like, hey, this is contradicting that, this and that. Third. So I trust the developers or the producers that they're going to get it right. Anyway, without further ado, oh, hope everyone's having a good day. Had a good day. And continue to have a good day. So, without further ado, let's get right into this with this trailer. Oh, let me just turn up the volume. I bet. I'm going to ask you a series of questions. I want you to respond truthfully. Have you ever hurt someone? Yes. Have you ever experienced anything you'd consider abnormal? Yes. Last question. I love that music. There's, that music is so, it's eerie yet captivating, you know? Like it's something about it, like it's, it's perfect, it's perfect. I love it. So it comes out in October. I don't know why the hell does it say 2019 though. At any rate, listen, listen. I'm gonna give you my idea of what may or may not happen already because I can't keep it in. I might forget it, but this is my take on it. I feel as if that Demigorgon thing, I don't know if they, I, don't, I can't remember if they actually named it, but the Demigorgon that's on the other side, the master, the master, 
initially when Eleven touched him, when she first opened the portal, first opened the portal, like a connection could have been established, whether it be psychic or whatever, it, it could have been established right then and there. Just like it was able to take over uh, the buyer's kid. Like, I really feel like it could have overtaken Eleven or L. you know what I'm saying? Because she was in direct contact with it, and they tried to say, or at least the father tried to say that, don't worry, whatever you experience in there is just going to be, it can't hurt you, basically, right? But uh, that's not necessarily true. That's not true at all because you you in the space in the the astral place of this place of this uh this entity as well. Why the hell couldn't it? It got will, you know what I'm saying? So I think L could be kind of like the I gonna say the the villain, but there could definitely be some suspicious activity revolved around her, you know. So at any rate, that's my take on it. It seems like in this this particular trailer that she was going through some type of issues of mental capacities or mental proportions, I meant. And um, I look forward to seeing what the hell is going to happen. Like, I really do. Like, And the fact that it's on Netflix is even better because it just comes out all that comes out at once. Like, who can... You can't beat that, you know what I mean? Like, the days of conventional television is done. Netflix is killing it. Like, when you can watch a full season, given that you have the allotted amount of time, you can't beat that. Like, you nobody wants to sit there and wait a week or two weeks or whatever until, like, another episode comes out, you know? Like, they want to see it when they want to see it, how they want to see it. At any rate, that's just my two cents on it. Hope you enjoyed the trailer. It's my first time seeing it, so I thought it was pretty awesome. Till next time, Nextinians. Trey Leo, out.